Hey guys, it's Jen. I know it's been a while since I've done a video, but um, I've been incredibly busy. I had to get ready for my son's birthday party, which, you know, entailed making all the decorations and, and all the party favors. So that kept me really busy. And also we had a teacher appreciation week at school. So I did all the gifts for the teachers. So that kept me really busy. And then on top of all, on top of it all, it's spring, so spring cleaning and yard work and all those things. But finally, I had time to sit down today and um, create. But I was terribly inspired because yesterday I was out running errands and I found these lampshades so, um, at a yard sale. So I was excited today to sit down and try to alter it and change it up a little. So there's the before on the left-hand side. And it's pretty the way it is. You know, I, I liked it, but... You know, of course, it's hard not to uh, change things up a bit and add your own touches to them, you know, you know, personalize it. So in the front here, um, I don't know, the lighting seems to not be the best. But if you can see this, this is like a rosette. Um, it was a fabric, and I just cut it in the shape of a butterfly. And then I dyed some white uh, fabric roses, like a dark olive green. And I also dyed this fabric um, in a, a light olive green. And they were, um, Lindy Stamp Gang is what I used to, uh, to, d to dye them. So, and I just added some, um, some feathers and some pearl trim. And then all along the top, if that's going to pick it up, let's hope, let's see if I can get a better angle, is, um, doilies that I just cut in half and scalloped them all the way around the top and, and the bottom here. And then I added up here up at the top and the bottom this uh, this kind of pearl trim here and this is a handmade flower that I made from my um, homemade loom that I made and I just uh, strung wire around the loom and then uh, I dyed this flower in the same olive green as I did the the um, butterfly and then I added a homemade pearl center that I made and then down here are some wild orchid craft flowers and then um wild orchid crafts these I dyed in the olive green too as well and then here's a crystal drop I put on each side of the flower bunch I also picked them up at the art sale I got a huge bag of them for 25 cents and sorry about my hands I was just dyeing things green so they're really messy and there's that another crystal drop and I did the same thing on this side. And then up there is just a flower I had for my stash. And um, some rosebuds that I also dyed in the same, the same green color. So I didn't do a lot. I kept it pretty simple. But that's my finished, finished project. And after this video, I'll put some before and after pictures if, if you want to see those that I did. So, well, thanks for joining me, guys, and have a great day.